welcome again to my youtube channel so we know that in so many different countries there's so many ways of celebrating weddings so for today's content i'm going to show you how i'm preparing for a traditional wedding a cameroonian traditional wedding back soon so as you can see i'm not even close to being ready um i've not even sold my dress yet but i asked my mother for her half material i got this one and this one i was actually thinking about which one i should take but i'm obviously going to take this one i really like the pattern i don't know i really like the pattern of this one and i do not actually spend a lot of time to look for a design to do because i do not really want this dress so i just went on pinterest and and I just picked a few things and I finally decided on a very simple design and I'm going to the tailor to the seamstress to give her my material. I just hope she's going to be there because I've not called. I'm not I've not said I'm coming. So where is now go and I hear that she's in the village, please go. Let's go. Three days later. Hi everyone, welcome to step two of my preparations for the traditional wedding. So today I'm going to be doing my hair and nails I had not actually mentioned it before but this wedding is my friend's older sister's wedding and uh, they live very far like in the interiors of the interiors of a place that I've never been to in my life and it's not exactly safe for me so ah all this preparation I have to go so A few moments later. Uh, finally. <laughs> I was finally done with the hair and I was going back home and this woman was calling me mom 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 ha I turned I thought, I thought something was wrong only for her to say come do your nails I'm done with the hair finally finished everything but then I wasn't able to do my nails why because there was like a fire at the market yesterday and so many shops burned so many people did not come today because like 
it's like paying tribute to the people who lost all that goods everything so like courage to all the people who lost things in that fire it's just another opportunity for you to rise back up don't give up fighting in korea we say fighting even though i'm not in korea but fighting anyways that's all for today see you tomorrow the next morning Wow. So since I was too traumatized to like make a video of like the entire thing that was happening to me, I'm just going to see what happened here. So when I finished my makeup, like my friend told me that it was going to start at twelve, so I should come early. And so I started doing everything early and then when I was done, she was telling me, no, 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 come at one o'clock. And I'm like, one o'clock, so where should I go to? So I just thought, ah, the friend that I went to yesterday, ah, she lives in town, let me go there. I went and sat in the house for like, till 1.30, till 1.30, and then she was telling me, oh, yeah, you can come now. Wow. I finally left, and then I was going out to the place that I don't even know, and then I took a bike like i took the directions that she gave me and then i was going there and then now we just got lost like like it was i thought it was a particular place that we had to drop but then now like i was not understanding and then i had to start calling people up and down i called my other friend i called her to call her mother and be asking for directions but then now luckily the the bike the bike man he like used his initiative and everything and then he took me and he actually dropped me in front of the door since it's like an occasion that kind of thing it's as if he knew where it was and then he went and left me there that was a traumatic event that took place before I arrived at the house and I was able to finally wear that dress. <laughs> So what was happening here was they were like embalming her with oil and then her sisters are like sending her off into the the the, the man's family like what's happening here is just performance of rights and all those things That's all about my vlog for today. Thanks for watching. Bye.